Hey, what's up, guys? This is Jason with SoundDesignStudio.net. Uh, first thing, of course, I want you to hit that subscribe button to make sure that we can stay in contact with you and you can stay in contact with us. Um, but if you clicked on the link, I already know what you want to get into. Um, this video is going to be over controlling your Behringer wing with um, your iPhone. So yes, you can control it with the iPad and Android apps, um, um, pads, and all that different kind of stuff. But you can control <coughs> your wing with your iPhone. And the way that you're going to do it, um, first of all, of course, you have to have a router. Um, the router that I'm using is the Linksys EA 6350. For me, it was pretty pr pretty much a plug and play situation. Uh, I went into the one of the network ports. You have two on the back. Uh, if you're faced towards the console, it would be the one to the furthest left. If you're on the back of the console, looking at the console, it's going to be the one that's furthest to your right. Um, that's what I went into. But <coughs> um, after you connect your router to your console, like I said, it was pretty much plug and play for me uh, with the router. Of course, what you want to do is make sure that your iPhone is on the same network as. So with my phone, if I go to <coughs> Wi-Fi, mine is the Linksys uh, 069 um one four so if I, i've already connected to it i've already put in my code and all that kind of stuff to connect to it and this and that because that's connected to <coughs> the console the next thing you do is but before before even before you get to that point you want to download the app mix station all right after you download the app um mix station let me pull that up for you. <coughs> After you download the app, it's going to come up. <coughs> the newest update for the app has right there um, where it says music group consoles and all that kind of stuff. You have the wing up under there. If you have an older um, version of MixStation, its wing is not on there so you have to do the update to get the wing tab on there so after you update mix station what are you going what you're going to do is click on wing and then you're going to do uh search and it says searching and it found my console after that you click on the console and there you go you're already connected and it should show up and it, and you can see where I'm talking through uh, the microphone. It's showing up on channel one. So with the Copilot app, um, not unless they just did an update and gave it out right now, but with the Copilot app, you can't m particularly mix uh, on the iPad or anything like that. So right now, mix station is the best uh, situation for that. So, and if you notice from here, you can see, you can control, you can control your console. You can mute, unmute, you can do so much with it. I mean, you can control everything with this app. So if, if that's the case, guys, go ahead and download MixStation. And so that app is on um, your iPhone, and it's also on your, um, your iPad uh, and other Android devices. So download MixStation so that you can control your console with uh, your iPhone or or whatever, or iPad or whatever, um, and this also works with other consoles too. So, 
All right, guys, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And this has been Jason with SoundDesignStudio.net. And get with us so we can stay in contact with you. Appreciate it. Bye.